James aka JD Rock and today I'm going to show you how I built this Spiral car. Um, it's the first of its kind, it's all custom built, I'm not affiliated with Spiral, uh, but let's get into the details and how I really built this thing. Okay so the first thing you'll notice is that I used a quadcopter frame and it's called a RoboCat quadcopter frame and you can get it from Hobby Kane or any kind of hobby shop will usually carry these frames. Now it's built out of carbon fiber so it's really light it's under 200 grams and you can't really get, go more than that because those uh, balls won't carry that weight. There's another thing that I did too is that I just used the uh, I cut off spheral chariots for them and I just used the ends of them so that's all I did and I drilled holes in them and I bolted it to the top of the quadcopter arm. So it's a really simple to do. Now this car, it only works on like hardwood flooring, tiles, linoleum, stuff like that. It doesn't really work on carpet, it just doesn't have the power. Um, it's just, it doesn't have the torque to get through it. Now another thing I did too is that I used the Spiro Multi Drive. It's an app that you can get for your phone. And you can control four balls at once. But when you're doing that, you have to really make sure that they're aligned because you don't want uh, them fighting each other um, on which way it's going. So that's key, is to have the multi-drive app. Um, thanks for watching the video and subscribe to my channel.